Hi Sagittarius, so it's L here to do your May 2019 general reading. It's a general reading, so it won't resonate with every Sagittarius who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Thank you to those who've already done so. Okay, so I've already pulled a few cards for us. Um, Sagittarius, we have past, present, near, future. Then we have the cards at the bottom of the deck. So for the first spread, we have the Two of Cups, Three of Swords, Judgment. It's almost consecutive, right? Um, so in the past, it was a successful relationship, a mutually beneficial um, relationship. Whether this is money, business, or this is love, it was mutually beneficial in the past. Presently, we are at the Three of Swords where we may be separated Um divorcing maybe due to infidelity maybe we'll, we'll jump into that um but there is a divide a divide of the heart it used to be two swords now it's three um you still love that other situation that other person but you also care for something else too or someone else and then you have yourself too so there's the divide there um near future is judgment uh so this is going to be a final call to action reviving a situation or this will be making the judgment call to because we have the ten of swords sitting on that judgment to completely end something allow an ending this is as far as it can go at the bottom of the deck we have the hermit so definitely there's separation here within what used to be a successful dynamic whatever that may be for you uh you, you may be the hermit or you may be dealing with the virgo but there might be separation and where the both of you are trying to self-reflect see what happened see what went wrong even talking to you know experts or um someone that you can um bounce idea off of but in a way of self-reflection uh, and, and you self-reflect so that you can then hopefully positively move forward out of that hermit stage or phase um, you may not be doing too much you may be kind of isolated if not isolated but uh, not dealing with too many friends too many family not going out or whatnot uh, you've got something heavy on your mind you have to think about what to do next okay uh, so then we have the next spread in the past was the ace of cups so there was love here uh the rekindling of love or new love or new friendship but presently it, it, the devil it may be toxic it may be riddled in addiction or addictive behavior or obsession um fears uh fear-based motives fear-based actions um third party situation of course um maybe divorcing from a situation where there was codependency or someone felt like there was heavy obligation and so they stayed near future is judgment and intense source which we talked about you're either going to release completely go from the three of swords to the ten of swords which would give us the seven of swords which is at the bottom of the deck um you're going to make a plan of action in secret see in secret to make either this happen uh, a complete ending happen at this point it looks like there's a grabbing of or grasping for straws and trying to get exactly what I want out of this situation now I no longer care about the two swords right we talked about there used to be two swords here or the two of cups I'm more so concerned with um, the five of swords what I can take because there's lots of change within an existing dynamic institution corporation religion or tradition traditional makeup of some sort 
there's change that happened here with the five of swords um i'm no longer worried about the two swords it doesn't matter at this point i need to get what i can get from here um so let's see let's see what the judgment in the ten of swords is what is the judgment in the ten of swords judgment in ten of swords Judgment to the sun. All right, your Okay, there we go. The sun. All right, so that's nice. Um, so either it's just a lot of things that's out of your control here. You know, the universe is making something happen. So either there's a, an illumination of something you see differently. The sun comes and illuminates, and, and now you say, okay, I can release, or what the cards are saying, and that could be both, is that this ultimate ending, release, betrayal that happened, back, feeling backed into a corner, and now having to go to the Seven of Swords type of energy, um, even though it's tough now, um, know that spirit is with you, God, or whomever, or whatever you believe in, know that okay the spirit will meet you on the other side but it's about getting to the other side what is the three of sword and the devil three of sword okay seven of wands um something that somebody was fighting for you could be dealing this could be you sag um you may have been trying to block out the fact that maybe you wanted this to end or you're trying to block out or fight for or defend yourself in regards to how you felt about this relationship, business partnership. You tried to gain control by way of of defending yourself or defending an idea. Some of you just defended the fact that you wanted to do what you wanted to do with the devil card here. Queen of Pentacles. You are trying to defend this addictive and obsessive behavior. Even something about money. Three of Swords again. Flew out of the deck. This may be a situation where you are trying to defend a mother figure somebody you're giving money to could be a Taurus we got the Hierophant at the bottom of the deck this relationship with either the mother of your children or your mother of some sort or somebody's mother or giving money to another party is toxic the cards say you need to divorce, separate from this idea because the swords are about thoughts that you need to you keep defending this person you keep defending this idea that you have to keep pouring into because you're so bogged down in the toxic energy that surrounds it okay so what we're going to do is see how the other person feels in this dynamic because there's some other people right or another person for my Sagittarius how does the other person feel and then we're going to clarify and get advice for Sagittarius over at the website always keep in mind the extended read is only two dollars if you feel like this reading is resonating with you thus far purchase the extended read and get a little bit more clarity about your situation the king of fire 
So the other person feels like the king of fire. You may be dealing with another air sign. Some of you just dealing with complete and utter heartbreak here. Um, in the near future, it gets better. You got to go through to get to the other side. Um, something took away something from you also here. It was all of a sudden. Uh, some of you go into spiritual teachers or you are a spiritual teacher. Okay. Or, or a spiritual person. The, king, the other person feels like the king of fire. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. They are after their heart's desire. Or, or they have set their eyes on what their heart desires. Okay. Justice. The other person could be a Libra. If not, um, the other person feels like the, the scales need to be weighed up. Things need to be put in place. The high priestess. The other person feels like there's always been secret plan or plans, especially in regards to money, career, no, like money and things on the books. Yeah. That's way too many. I want to put those back. If they come back out, we'll take them. Some of you, um, the other person feels like you're weighing up the divorce, the separation, or to bring in some type of justice. Uh, but you're also holding close to your um, chest what it is you're going to do with this high priestess here. You also may have something or someone in the, in the wings waiting for you. Th this is a person that doesn't do much. She, this is the sh feminine energy. She sits and does nothing. Strength. Uh, so you're definitely dealing with a Leo. Some of you may be trying to, okay. Oh, some of you may be trying to contact a dead person. Some of you go into a medium. That's probably like for one person, maybe two. I don't know. Um, Ten of Swords, Eight of Swords. Some of you are stuck. Or the other per this other person is um, trying to have enough strength to have change here, or allow an ending to at least get to the nine, where you know that. It could very well end, or you could choose to put work in and reduce and, and allow it to stay. But some of you, your other person may just be trying to be strong and um, taking a lot of action and going after what they desire. They have some secret plans about uh, what they're going to do. They're trying to be strong in doing so and having this ending because they feel betrayed. Uh, they can't. They don't. They don't think very positively about, and they think heavily about what to do surrounding this this um, betrayal, this ending. The four stores at the bottom of the deck. You guys are definitely, if not in full on separation, you know, not living together or cohabitating in some type of way. You're you're not even talking either. Or if you are still living together, there's a complete divide. Some of you can be dealing with the Virgo. Your other person just feels like um, you want the divorce or you want the, the separation. And they're just have, trying to be strong in allowing it to happen. They may even have secret plans or vice versa. This is the person's energy. So they may feel like you have secret plans. They have secret plans. They're trying to be strong. In allowing an ending here because it's hurting the both of you uh, which are also um, somebody's trying to heal to heal okay so we're gonna go over to the other side and get advice for Sagittarius okay and um, I hope that it resonated with you for you. If it did, go ahead and click that like button. Meet me on the other side. We can get advice here. 
in regards to maybe um yeah it looks like ending heartbreak um, something sudden for some of you something gradual for a lot of you uh just really just trying to allow that ending to get over the ten of swords to get to just wanting to do what's right and fair even in the midst of um some betrayal and uncertainty and some unfairness okay all right so sagittarius thank you for listening to the reading um know that i'm praying for you pray for me as well take care guys